window, underscore tabula equals window, underscore tabula, underscore tabula, push mode, thumbnail C, container, tabula interstitial gallery thumbnails 5, placement, interstitial gallery thumbnails 5, target underscore type, mix, underscore tabula, push flush, true, window, underscore tabula equals window, underscore tabula, underscore tabula, push mode, thumbnail C, container, tabula interstitial gallery thumbnails 7, placement, interstitial, Gallery thumbnail 7 feet, target underscore type, mix, underscore tabula, push flush, true, woodlands area law enforcement gather in honor of National Police Week nothing brings people together faster than barbecue on a hot Texas day. That was true on Tuesday, May 15th, when dozens of Woodlands-based law enforcement joined forces in honor of National Police Week at the Central Fire Station on Grogan's Mill Road to mingle and get to know one another, while enjoying smoked brisket, chicken and cold potato salad. Eric Seckerist, president of the Woodlands Professional Firefighters Association, said the lunch was a way for the organization to recognize police officers around the Woodlands and to show them support for keeping our community safe. It was also a way to honor those in law enforcement who have died in the line of duty, he said. I think they are in an underappreciated profession, Sekarist said of law enforcement personnel. It's important to remind them that they are appreciated, maybe not by everybody, but by us. I think the overwhelming response is that most people appreciate them. Firefighters, Shenandoah police officers, deputies from the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office and Precinct 3 Constable Ryan Gable's office laughed and shared stories with one another while enjoying home-cooked barbecue from firefighter dad-son duo, Brandon and Bob Moore. It's just the obvious thing to cook. Everybody likes barbecue, Sekarist said about the spread. If we had tried anything else, somebody wouldn't have liked it. Everybody likes barbecue in Texas, Montgomery County Sheriff's Deputy Momin Abdelbaki had just finished a plate of spaghetti pasta and brisket. He said he appreciated the show of support from other public safety personnel, whom he only gets to see at crime scenes or car wrecks. When you're on a scene, you don't have time to sit and talk and mingle and get to know one another. Abdelbaki said, we just all got our job to do and after we are done, we all go our separate ways. We should have these more often. We don't ever get together as much as we should. We never really get to know who these people are. Obviously some of them know how to cook some really good barbecue. Who would have known? Shenandoah Police Detective Joel Gordon said Tuesday's lunch was about building camaraderie within the law enforcement community. Communication and the camaraderie, but mostly the communication. Gordon said of what he enjoys about events like the lunch. South Montgomery County in particular, you have seven or eight different law enforcement agencies working in a 20 square mile radius. We are all dealing with the same people, so it helps to communicate. Gordon said he normally sees other officers and deputies on only a weekly basis. It's nice to kick back and relax. It's a lot of fun, he said of the get-together. I just had the pulled pork. It was excellent. Michelle Iricetta, 